Hey there. Oh, my goodness. Lauren, Jonathan, we were doing it up big time here in downtown White Sulphur Springs, if you consider pizza and a Mr. Pib big time. But here in downtown White Sulphur Springs, not exactly the Washington Ave corridor or even Midtown, but the people here, they do like to come out and have fun, but they're a little more reserved in this neck of the woods. A Friday night in White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia. There aren't a lot of these downtown. In a city of 2,200 people, most of who work at the local Greenbrier Resort, downtown mostly shuts down at 9 o'clock. Slow-mo. <laughs> We're in slow mode. I'm from California, so moving here took me six years, actually, to calm down <laughs> from the pace of life here. Just a handful of restaurants stay open past 9 o'clock, but no nightclubs or so-called hot spots to venture into. On a weekend, every Sunday, there's a happy Sunday, we call it, and we celebrate it in the 50 East. And sometimes we hang out with the friends, drinks, like that, and just that. But it's so quiet here. There's a lot of different entertainment, uh, local bands, and stuff like that. Just not tonight. But that's the point. People don't live in White Sulphur Springs to party. Like the tourists who visit, they're here to slow down, relax, and unplug to have a good time. It's a hometown place, and it's a place to feel comfortable, to come home here to eat and have good food, and everybody's always welcome. Yeah, and there actually are a really lot of good places here to eat in White Sulphur Springs and the surrounding communities as well. And people here are genuinely very, very nice. I would recommend this place to visit to anyone. Just don't expect to stay up too late on a Friday night or any night for that matter. Reporting live from downtown White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia, Keith Garvin, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Well, that sounds pretty good to me, Keith. Uh -huh. Thank you.